गुड इवनिंग माइ डर फ्रेंड्स ओलकम टू माइ चेल इन माइ प्रिभिया भिड आई हाव अलरेडी डिस्कस एबाउट वर्किंग अफ ह्यूम आईज टूडे आई विल डिस्कस एबाउट डिफेक्ट अफ भिजन एंड द केयर अफ द आई सो उदाउट डिले लेट स्टार्ट द टपिक फास्ट आई विल डिस्कस एबाउट ह्वाट इज मायोपिया और नियर साइटेडनेस ना मायोपिया इज ए डिफेक्ट अफ द आई ड्यू टू हिज आई इज अनेबुल टू सी द डिस्टास् अबजेक्ट क्लीयरली सो व्हाट इज मायोपिया ना मायोपिया इज ए डिफेक्ट अफ द आई ड्यू टू हिज आई इज नट एबुल टू सी द डिस्टास् अबजेक्ट क्लीयरली इन सच एंड आई द लाइट रेज फ्रम ए डिस्टास् अबजेक्ट इट इज आरइिंग एट द आई लेंस एंड इट गेट्स कनभर्स एट ए पॉइंट इन फ्रंट अफ द रेटिना एंड दिस डिफेक्ट मे आरइजेस ड्यू टू आईदर एक्सेसिव कर्भेचर अफ द कर्निया और इलंगेसन अफ द आईबल हाउ दिस डिफेक्ट कैन भी करेक्टेड एंड दिस डिफेक्ट कैन भी करेक्टेड बै यूजिंग ए कनकेप लेंस अफ द आप्रोप्रिएट फोकल लेंथ सो फर दिस वी हाव टू यूज कनकेप लेंस अफ आप्रोप्रिएट फोकल लेंथ देन कम टू हाइपर मेट्रोपिया और फार साइटेडनेस ना इन दिस डिजिज वी मे हाव सी सम मिडल एज पीपुल होल्डिंग ए बुक समट आवे फ्रम देयर आईज टू रिड इट प्रपरली दिस इज बिकज दे आर सफरी फ्रम हाइपर मेट्रोपिया इन दैट केस द इमेज अफ नियर बै अबजेक्ट गेट फर्स बिहड द रेटिना दिस डिफेक्ट आरइजेस ड्यू टू आई द फोकल लेंथ अफ आई लेंस बिकमिंग टू लार्जर आर द आई बल गेटिंग सर्टेन एंड दिस डिफेक्ट कैन भी करेक्टेड यूजिंग ए कनभेक्स लेंस of appropriate focal length here is the ray diagram of myopia and its correction and hypermetropia and its correction so so in myopia it rays from distance object and image formed in front of the retina and this de defect can be corrected by using concave lens of appropriate focal length and this is the ray diagram of hypermetropia and this disease can be corrected by convex lens of appropriate focal length sometimes during old age the eye lens of some people became hazy or even opaque uh, why it is happen and this is happen because of the development of a membrane over it when this happens this portion is said to have cataract and this leads to decrease or loss of vision of the eye so due to cataract कैटरेक्ट द डिक्रीज और लॉस ऑफ भिजन अकर्स इट इज पॉसिबल टू रिस्टोर भिजन इन सच केस दिस इज डन बाय द रिप्लेसमेंट ऑफ अपैक्यूलेंस विथ ए न्यू आर्टिफिशियल लेंस सो बाय अपैक्यूलेंस दिस डिफेक्ट कैन बी करेक्टेड देन कम टू केयर ऑफ द आईज ना इट इज आई विच अलाउ अस टू सी एंड interpret the shape colors and dimension of different object in the world our eyes are therefore a great asset to all of us so we therefore need to take proper care to protect them and keep them healthy so for the proper care of the eye we have to follow some precaution to ensure the health care and proper functioning of the human eye so for this first we have to regular check up our eye if so advise use the correct spectacles then never look at the sun or any other powerful light source directly and have sufficient light in the room when you are reading writing or watching television poor lighting in the room causes eye strain and try not to spend too much time looking continuously at computer screen or television it can cause eye strain eat a balanced diet having lots of fruits and vegetables lack of vitamin a in the food is responsible for many eye problem including night blindness so we have to is eat plenty of vitamin a food gently wash eyes frequently with clean or potable water and know your family history some of the vision problems may be inherited that is they may run in the family then come to visually challenged person it is difficult to imagine the world without a pair of functional eyes so it is however an unfortunate fact that many among us including children do not have this unique gift of nature 
It is, however, not possible for them to bravely face this challenge by effectively, effectively overcoming their limitation and lead to a near normal life. Such a brave and courageous visually challenged person deserve our appreciation and full support for their courage and conviction. So, vision problem may be due to some illness such as diabetes, glaucoma, cataract or vitamin A deficiency. They can also be due to genetic or inherited problems. The problem gets transferred to kids from parents through their genes. In some unfortunate case, some person lose their vision due to some accident also. So, visually challenged person can either have limited vision or partial loss of vision or may have complete loss of vision. Hence, all visually challenged person cannot not be treated alike. And their individual problems and requirement need to be taken into consideration. Most visually challenged person have a better sense of touch, smell or hearing than the normal people. Such person try to identify things by developing their other sense more sharply and putting them to effective use. Then come to the help of visually challenged person. In modern technology also helps them to further develop their capability. The vast majority of these people with partially and complete lack of vision can be held to function at a higher level with use of additional resources aids. Now what is this resource? The re these resources can be of two types. First one is non-optical aids, second one is optical aids. First come to non-optical aids. Now what is non-optical aids? Now this often includes tactual aids using sense of touch. The visually impaired can learn to read and write by using a special touch system called Verily. This system makes use of rays, dots or put on a paper. And second one, auditory. That means using a sense of hearing aids including audio cassettes, tape recorder, audio CD, audio books and other electronic devices like computer, calculator or closed circuit television. It make use of software program and that can transfer text file into sign. Then come to the optical aids. Now optical aids include lens and telescopic aids. While suitable lens combination are used to rectify visual limitation. The telescopic aids can help us to view class demonstration and in the blackboard also. Then come to belly system. The most effective resource for visually challenged person is the belly. Now, no one scientist named Louis Belly himself a visually challenged person developed a system for visually challenged person and published it in 1821. The present system was adopted in 1932. And Belly is a coded language based on a logical system. And these are barely codes for common language as well as mathematical and scientific notation. Many languages like foreign or Indian can be can be read using the barely system. And barely system has 63 dot patterns or characters. And this pattern when embossed on barely sheets, it helps visually challenged person to recognize word by touching. To make them easier to touch, the dots are raised are lightly. Each character has to be mem memorized. Belly text can be produced by hand or by machine, printing machine or typewriter. Then come to do you know section. In belly system has 63 dot, dot pattern or character. Here is a pictorial representation of belly system. The belly character make, make up the letter of alphabet, punctuation marks. It is C and the dots characters are arranged in cell of two vertical rows of three dot is. Patterns of dot used to represent letter of the English alphabet are shown in this pictorial representation. So this is all about uh, our human eye. So if you have any query, you can put your query in my comment box. Thank you. For if you like my video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.